Right, uh, last night um, spotted another light, ghost lights I call them, over the uh, Cluden range. Really bright and it was a big full moon too last night. Massive super moon or whatever they call them. And there was this light just to the right of a mountain I'll show you in a minute called Penaclothier. And it was big, really bright and I thought, when I first looked at it, I thought, Oh, it's a star, you know, something, you know, that with it being like the, the moon was so bright, like, as well, you know, I thought, you know, it, it was a just a bright star, unusually bright star. So anyway, I was just look, looking at it, I thought, you know, should I get my camera or whatever? I was just looking round. Next minute, it dimmed slightly, and I thought, funny, perhaps a cloud or something, you know, has gone in front of it, and then it started moving right to left again. Liked it from the camera, came back, and it was gone. It was just just very faint, but just dropped behind the mountains, heading towards a Moyla Park mountain, and then just dropped down behind. So I missed it, completely missed it. So what I've got now um, is a camera set up because it always seems to be around this time of the year that these lights start appearing. I've seen a lot of them, but like I say, missed it missed them because I didn't have my camera at the, to hand and also uh, I've also got quite a few on my uh, channel, my uh, Denby Vids channel but anyway what I've got set up now is as you can see I've got a camera now on the tripod so pan and tilt is going to be nice and steady and all I've got to do is know if I, you know, come to the uh, this window. I keep checking every, well, every sort of twenty minutes, half an hour. I keep checking over the Cludians there, and if I spot something, all I've got to do is just literally just switch the camera on, and I should get something. Uh, that uh, the one I spotted last night. The zoom's not very good on this. That's Penaclothier there. It was just to the right of it there, and then it started moving across towards Moyla Park, which I don't know if you can it's making out the TV mask, but it didn't quite get as far as there. It got about as far as there, and it just dipped down behind the mountain. So anyway, I'll keep this camera uh, by this window now every evening. I don't see them during the day, it's mainly, mainly lights at night and there's a lot of Denbyites say that, uh, that they've spotted these lights and they, they tend to start up around this time of year. So anyway, like I say, just keep that camera set up on a tripod so and if any of the uh, any of these uh, ghost lights or UFOs are up here, I'll bump to get it on camera.